Okay, now this time, ituturo natin sa inyo kung paano mag-cancel ng voucher. No? Ang canceling ng voucher, ginagamit natin yan. If pwedeng talagang ika-cancel natin yung voucher by means of siguro hindi natuloy yung transaction natin or if there are adjustments to the voucher just like turns. Take note no, sa internal control kasi dapat kung magkano yung nag appear sa voucher yun din yung amount na i-issue natin. So if there are purchase returns, so babawas yun dun sa ating payable So, dapat, ang gawin natin, i-cancel natin yung voucher and then mag-create tayo ng panibagong voucher. Just like ito yung example natin na situation. No? October 5, return defective merchandise to Blanche Manufacturing Company and received a 11,200 credit memo. Okay? So, first, paano ba yan? Hanapin muna natin yung voucher coming from Blanche. So, tingnan natin sa disbursement module. Ito yung list of vouchers. Tapos, hanapin mo yung kay Blanche. Ito. Nag-iisa lang naman yata yan. Ito, no? So, i-review natin to This is the purchase that happened on October 2. Ginawa natin yan dun sa previous videos, no? So, ito siya. Yung 3,584 units, no? Ng T100. So now, pag na-open mo na siya, simple lang naman na gagawin mo, click mo tong cancel voucher. So, tatanungin ka, magpo-prompt, are you sure you want to cancel? Yes. Yes mo lang yan. No? It means makakancel din yung previous entry na ginawa natin. Okay, so cancel na siya. That's stamped as canceled. Tignan natin lang no, kung ano yung nangyari dito sa voucher niya exit natin to ayun, kung titignan mo, nag update siya no, yung voucher na to previously, nakalagay cancel wala na siyang balance eh no now next, nagagawin natin create tayo ng bagong voucher, no, so tinuro naman natin sa inyo yun so create tayo ng voucher to blanch Okay, medyo anuhin lang natin yung mga ano natin kanina, no? Create tayo October 4. Siya, no? October 5. Okay, yung due date, let's say dagdagan lang natin siya ng... Eh, saka lang, i-review natin yung ano nga kanina na yun, yung kay Blanche wala naman siyang ibang binigay nito ah 210 and 60 no, dagdagan natin pala siya ng ayun due date natin last time yata is 12 forgot no pero check na lang yan or yeah 12 now i adjust lang natin no to 100 tapos ano nga yun t-shirts plain white, now adjust natin yung amount kasi dati kung titignan natin yung voucher natin before that is 179 200 yan, pag binuksan mo yung coming from Blanche na document invoice 809 less natin yung 11,200 So, ito na lang yung amount natin 168. Take note, no? This is divided into 50 pesos na unit price. So, 3,360 na lang. Ito na yung bago natin. 3,360 Ay, sorry, may na-include pala ako na. Ayan, 3,360 take 50. No? So, yan. 168 na lang siya. So, ganun pa rin yun. Include natin siya yung ginawa natin before. That is for purchases. Validate mo lang yung entry and then i-save mo. So, once na na yan, okay na siya. So, record na tayo ng bagong voucher from Blanche 168. Okay? So, ganun lang yun guys. No? Kung magka-cancel ka ng voucher, 
and if you want to create the new voucher just like the usual na ginagawa natin okay so that's it goodbye